sweets, jellies, icing, and of course, gingerbread. This is pastry chef Brisaida Hernandez, and she will be taking us through the meticulous and delicate process of decorating a gingerbread house. To start off, we'll decorate the roof. After prepping the surface with icing, malted shreddies are selected and used as roof tiles. This process is repeated on all four pieces. Next, we move to the front of the house. An outline of doors is drawn with white icing. Sweets are used to add extra touches. Clear gelatin slates are cut and used as windows. They are attached to the underside of the gingerbread piece. Royal icing is used to add small touches like flowers and wreaths. Before assembling the house, the base is covered with icing to act as cement for the building blocks. The borders of the walls are prepped and carefully stuck together two at a time. Once the four walls are stuck, we move on to the roof. What follows is probably the most creative stage of the whole process, the decoration stage. Here, the artist uses familiar sweets and confectionery to resemble parts of the house, such as a footpath made out of midget gems or a fence from Jelly Babies. The house is topped off with icing sugar to act as snow. And now, after several hours of work, the house is complete. <laughs>